just realized I forgot my funny little characters. I'll fix that right now. <coughs> Hello, everyone. This is Super Galaxy Sam here. Totally not talking on a desk microphone. Surrounded by all sorts of crap because I'm... I, I do be doing cosplay stuff, you know, it, it do be like that. But, uh, yes, hello, hello everyone, we are playing Hate to Fall Boyfriend today. And then a reminder, I'm not streaming tomorrow nor Sunday because it's New Year's Eve and New Year's Day. And I will not be streaming during the week of Anime Los Angeles because I'll be down at the convention, so... You know, I can't, I, I cannot be in two places at once and then for the latter and then for the first one, it's a holiday. <laughs> okay. Let me quickly let people know I'm live. I literally just went downstairs to make some tea and then uh, forgot, 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 forgot to uh, notify folks that I'm streaming. So let me do that real quick. Okay. By the way, y'all, um, I have managed to buy, it's, it's not shipped yet, but I did manage to buy off of Amazon a video capture card for a Nintendo Switch, and then, uh, alongside with it, I went ahead and, since I just had the money, I said, fuck it, I'll buy, um, an analog to digital converter for um, gaming consoles that use audio video analog plugs instead of the HDMI, such as my GameCube. I have a GameCube and a Dreamcast. I would love to play uh, my pre existing old games. I would love to pull up my old gaming systems that have been collecting dust out to play for you guys. So, you know, that's that's something to look forward to if that works out. Um, the... Connector and the capture card is expected to arrive here on the 3rd. So just a day before Anime Los Angeles starts. So, yeah. We'll see, we'll see how that all goes. We'll see if it arrives on time and if we can use it. Anyhow, anyhow, let's go. You know what? Screw it. Let's go with the new game. Fuck it. I can't remember if, like, we. Bing. Bingus. <laughs> Bongus. There we go. We'll just we'll just go with random ass names each time. Volume mixer. Hateful boyfriend is being very loud. Is Bingus Bongus okay? Yes, it's totally fine, guys. Sure. Yep. We're just gonna speed through this because we already know what's up. By the way, I almost caught a rock pigeon down in LA the other day. Uh, the pigeon had like an injured wing, so I was like, oh, maybe I should try capturing it. And bring it home so it can recover. Because it was just going to die anyways. But the pigeon got away. It was able to somewhat fly, but it clearly had an injured wing.
Oto-san, Oko-san. I got... <laughs> thought it was, uh, Oto-san. It's Oko. Oko-san. Anyways. Oh, this exposition. He's almost as bad as the doctor. Attend music class. Okay, we can skip this. We're gonna be in the library. Okay. So they're talking about Brian again. Go to the library. Fuck everything else. 
fuck you. I guess... I guess I will go to the cafeteria. Oh no, not Oko-san. <laughs> Today is Friday, right? Yeah, it is. Interesting. I want to see the world domination shit happen. Bingus Bongus, yeah. Bingus Bongus will do well and succeed. Uh, Ore Hato Okay, well he wasn't too impressed with the first option and now he wasn't too impressed with that option. Okay. This again.
Okay, can we invite Nageki? Yes. <laughs> what? Please. Okay, we've seen this. Study in the library. Wait. More music. Okay, we've seen this part. The molting thing. No. <laughs> okay. It was? I hadn't realized. Oh my god. Oh, 
Oh. Is he agoraphobic? Is, does he have agoraphobia? Is that it? What? What's with Nageki? Oh, is he dead? I am Confusion. <laughs> what is this boy's problem? Fulfillment and conquest! Fulfillment and conquest! <laughs> I, I'm gonna keep choosing that till I see the fucking conquest ending.
Yes, we chose the right right one. I'm pretty sure he's dead, kiddo. Wait, can he go outside? <clears throat> what? 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 You're dead. You're dead. like Pokemon Mystery Dungeon shit. If you know, you know. If you know, you know. Man. <laughs> Geki's ending is so fucking sad. 
So we got Otto. Um, the teachers that is totally not okay. Nagekis. We got the one where like. Why the fuck do we have a halberd? Oh yeah, we got, uh... That one. So many wild endings. <laughs> Here... Sands. Undertale. Or Undertow. That's fine. Okay, racist much. It's like, aren't you Japanese? He's like, no, I am French. And it's like, okay, right, that still kind of, kind of rude. Pretty fucking rude to, to call an entire race dumb. But all right. Man, I want some fucking good udon and ramen.
blah 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 We'll just do the three-legged race. Go to the ba 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 da ba ba da. A cafeteria. <laughs> what should I do? Here, tell you what I'm getting sleepy. I'm getting sleepy. Okay, cool. Um, okay. I have a feeling Ryota's the bird that keeps disappearing during the summer. Because I don't think you hear f from Ryota after a certain point if you haven't talked to him.
<laughs> Work! Work, bitch! Work! No. He's just like, I'm a pampered little boy. I don't know how to do shit. So when you give me hard things, I'm just gonna stand here confused. It's like, okay, man. Yakitori is amazing. Oh. <laughs> I'm gonna grab my burp. I'm gonna grab penguin. 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 Hi. Hey, penguin. Okay, guys, I got penguin with me. Penguin. There you go. There you go, boy. -o.
Oh, we get the sussy talk. No, you're not going on the desk. Penguin. No desk. No desk, penguin. Work in a maid cafe or working at a cafe. Take your pick. Maybe both. I have to remember, this game was, like, made in the early 2010s. Oh no, not- don't tell me, his mum. So basically, she's in hospice right now.
Bro, why are we getting two depressing ass endings in one stream right before the end of the year? Man. Hooray for getting two depressing, two two depressing endings in a row! Holy shit! First, we get one about the student that committed suicide, so he forgets. He ends up with amnesia and only remembers when we started paying attention to him because no one else could see him. And then he's like, "Oh shit, that's right, I killed myself," and as a result, I ended up as a ghost stuck in this library. And the second one's like. Yeah, my mom's in the hospice. Hospice. Oh yeah, my mom died. I can't bear this anymore, so let's stop being friends. It's like, man. <laughs> Okay, next one. What should it be this time? Oh yeah, big. Big floppa. There we go. Touch it. Or 
Okay, fine. I was gonna select neat nip, but my mouse is a little off. <sighs> you yeah. Okay, fine. I'll just talk to Sakiya then. Okay. Feel like I'm a shiny. What should I do during break? Go to the for um. Yuya. I'm gonna go for like Yuya's path.
Okay. Uh, are we not getting the Yuya ending? <laughs> Probably not. Uh, Yuya must be fucking dead. <laughs> that that's probably what's gonna happen here. Yuya you know is gonna be turned into squab pie. Oh. Yeah, no, you is fucking dead. Littering is bad, doctor! Ha! You're not putting two and two together! Yuya is dead!
sus. Fucking sus. The sauce. Where is this gonna go? As per usual, that's just the routine around here.
Interesting. What can we get? No! 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 We got this fucking ending! Fuck! God damn it! I was hoping we were like... See what's up with the sussiness. Here, I'm just gonna load up a random ass file. So I basically gotta do the same shit, except I guess I tell, um, the doctor I'm interested in him.
Come on, I want to know what the doctor's fucking secrets are. Give me the doctor! <laughs> Give me the doctor! <laughs> No, fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. Title. I'm like, no! <laughs> give, give me thing. Give me. Now I'm like, mm, you know what? Yeet you touch to the corner, or you yet to the corner. Fuck you, I wanna see what the doctor's up to. So you're gonna die again. You're gonna die a third time?
No, we don't want your creepy ass ending. I'm sorry. We don't want. We don't want your ending. I already got it. I don't need it again. Okay, here we go. Sassy bird time. Suspicious bird. Sassy bird. Okay. Better hurry, boy. gonna fucking gank you at some point I'm sure 
but pop off, go be naive. This is new. <laughs> oh boy. Oh boy. Oh fucking boy. Oh boy. <laughs> no, that's your classmate. That was Yuya. That was a fantailed pigeon. You had squab there, girl. Conquest, conquest, give, give me, give me. Chickens! A silky! It's a little black one. I was like, when are they ever are they ever gonna mention chickens in this game? the creepy doctor okay this is gonna be the same dialogue okay uh it's gonna be the same shit racing blend I guess shrug though that's for like Oko-san pretty sure oh okay Oh boy, the fucking Nutcracker song playing in the background. Welcome to the stream. 
how are you? I I was recommended to play this game from um fellow cosplayer Sky Endrin. Sky suggested I play this and I was like, "Oh, I have it in my library already from when I was gifted it a couple years back by one of my online friends, Louie. So, yeah. And thank you for the lurk. We're trying to figure out what the fuck's going up with this doctor. I I can tell. It's an interesting game. Oh, hang on. I'm saving. Oh, shit. Oh shit. We found a dead student, guys! Oop a boo! A body's been discovered! Oh no, we're gonna fucking die. We're gonna fucking die! Oh, that would have been fun. I would have liked that. Bird breed and bird species. That's not creepy at all. That's not creepy at all. Our, our protagonist is so fucking naive to not be able to put two and two together. Oh my gosh. Oh my god. <laughs> Listen, I'm sure, I actually can't remember if partridge is eaten in certain parts of the world. I think it is. I know pigeon is. And I know quail is. What? What the fuck? What the fuck's with this dude? Man. Well, at least we got the doctor's ending, question mark? I think we did. Please, why are you t changing the subject from our dead body to, hey, cheese danishes are delicious. You guys should have one.
Girl just wrote some. Yeah. Just, just cook him. I, I do not know. <laughs> I do not, so I shall break you once more. What do you mean? <laughs> he don't get an option to say no? What? <laughs> oh my god. Well, he killed us. Twice. Oh, does he get to fucking die? Oh. Well, I guess his, uh, status is left to a question mark. <laughs> God. Yeah. Yeah. My character has gone to double hell. The happy couple. <gasps> couple. The happy. Yeah, that is totally a happy couple. <laughs> Get the shoe ending. The happy couple. Yay. It's funny because I was going for Yuya's and then. Uh, I accidentally killed Yuya, and found out you could get the doctor's ending finally, or get more dirt on the doctor, so I was like, Alright, time to kill Yuya two more times! So, I, I murdered Yuya two more times in cold blood. Did you find the pudding? No, I didn't. I never found the pudding for Okosan. At least in game. In real life, I visited I visited Little Tokyo, um, because I was down there doing some errands, and there was some pudding there. So I was like, "Oh, I will try this pudding and see if it's like, so if it's really good pudding to where like I could see why <laughs> they'd have a character obsessed with pudding." It was okay. I liked it. It wasn't my thing though. I, I personally like, like, flan and all that stuff, so. I will name them your mum. There. I feel like it would be an insult to entry if I go ahead and, uh, do... You just route again with your mum as the player's name. I, I'm not that cruel. I'm not gonna do that. <laughs> then the Latino flan they sell at Walmart. Yeah, I've noticed. Well, actually. Technically, the pudding I bought was less of a pudding pudding, but more like a Japanese custard. But I do agree, um... About... Yeah, about the, uh, Latino flan. Because I've had, like... That type of flan over here, um... At the local, like, Ralph's. Yeah, it is. I'm gonna skip through all this because I've seen this so many times. <laughs> okay, time to focus on um, getting new yes. I will say the custard that I bought over in Little Tokyo. Hello, Romsuk. Welcome to the stream. We're playing Hateful Boyfriend. 
We're trying to get all the different endings. Uh, in this stream, we found out that one student was a ghost, the other's uh, mom died, and uh, we got murdered by a very suspicious doctor. We got murdered by a very sussy doctor. So we got murdered by this dude. I'm speeding through because it's like, I've seen this so many times. Sally. <laughs> Sally, I'm speeding through it just to like, get through all of this and not have to repeat it over and over again. So now, we're gonna go ahead and stick to Yuya without accidentally killing Yuya. Try not to be a murder challenge, please! Listen, just because we accidentally killed Yu Yuya once and then intentionally killed him two more times for the sake of finding out the doctor's secrets doesn't mean that this time I'm gonna kill Yuya again. Because we've already took care of the doctor, so I just want to focus on getting Yuya's ending. Thumbs up. <laughs> And I think, um, I'll do Oko-san's ending again, but this time I'll, like, reject following him to, like, reject, uh, playing hooky to, um, find out this secret pudding with him. Because Oko-san's ending I actually got before, where, um, you go, yeah, I'll join you, Oko-san. We're, we're gonna go look for the pudding. <laughs> So, I kind of want to see what happens when you, like, reject the pudding. Yes, because someone has to state it to you. <laughs> you can't you can't just hit on girls like that or anyone really. It's not a good idea. Oh yeah, and I've been uh, trying, I've been constantly choosing to, uh, choosing the decision to desire conquest and hope something will happen. <laughs> like, I'm going to keep choosing that option until I find something that allows me to do something with that, like, decision or that route. Conquest. What? That's new. You know what? I'm gonna select this. Fuck Conquest.
<laughs> it's kind of funny to see. Oh, is that you, Mom? Attention, Jim. He's a mama's boy, yeah. To be fair, his mom's dying, but... <laughs> he's, he's, he's trying his best. He's trying his best to be independent. Is that like the half-dead fried rice? Oh no. You're new? You're a bleeding lo- You're, um... You're a Luzon. What the fuck? No. Luzons are like from the Philippines. Yes. Also known as the Bleeding Heart Dove. There's a whole Filipino myth about, um, about how the bleeding heart stain for the Luzon came to be. Oh, I like his design. I, I want to bet, my, my assumption is, as a fellow Filipino, though a Philippine, like American, mixed Filipino, I want to bet he's probably Filipino himself. And loaf, yeah, borbs and loafing positions is real cute. I, I own chickens, I own eight chickens, and I love it when my uh, birds loaf. They, since they're the chickens I have are I'm Chimani's, they're all black, and so they end up looking like little black boys of bread. I think you've picked up a weird one, Yor. They're actually pretty clean. It's less like they t they uh, give themselves dust bag dust baths and everything, but yeah, you do have to like clean up after them or have them like temporarily wear a bird diaper. Mine can't refuse to wear diapers. They cannot stand it, so I'm often constantly cleaning up after them. Which I tolerate because I'm used to having to clean up after people all the time back from my days of working in fast food and also from previously owning a rabbit. What the fuck is your deal? <laughs> okay, the eye, the eye stare throws me off. <laughs> what the, what the text? I want free eggs though. I mean, it's totally possible to only own like one or two bird, 
one or two chickens. You don't have to necessarily own a whole flock if you just want to keep one as a pet. But, yeah, you do have to, like, clean up after them like any other, uh, pet bird. Yeah, Luzon bleeding hearts are from the Philippines. <laughs> Why do you have to be so racist? Yeah, the worst way of finding out. But man. <laughs> yeah, exactly. A fallen angel. <laughs> what the fuck is going on? Also, the name Angel, even though that is a very interesting way to spell it, is a pretty common name. But yeah, just just fry Sakuya. Make him make him cooked squab. <laughs> My dude. Do you have an injured wing? This is just getting weird, and I like it. Also, even though the way I found out the confirmation that yes, he's Filipino is probably through a character being so fucking racist to him, I'm also like, oh hey, a character who's Filipino who, who I could possibly cosplay, I, I'm, I'm down for it. To an eccentric Filipino breaking down the door. Bitch, I'm that eccentric Filipino. Mixed Filipino, but... <laughs> oh, boy. Chuni? I can't remember what a Chuni is. Uh, fuck. There, I l honestly, I low-key don't know that many canonical Filipino characters in media, so. It's, it's kind of oddly nice to see. Weirdest way to find out that he's Filipino, but it's like, yay, an another, another Filipino character. <laughs> Though I seriously don't know what his fucking deal is, oh my god. But at least now I know how to like, get him to appear I guess. Lao. To blow. It'll blow. Get a job. Yeah, you can get a job at a little cafe. But I think as 
from what I've seen so far, it either unlocks some stuff for uh, Ryuta or for um, the Sparrow, the Java Sparrow. And I've already got the whack ass Java Sparrow ending, so... And I've already done Ryuta, so I'm just kind of like, yeah. What angel appeared? <laughs> charm I forgot what a chuni uh bio is You're good Interesting. Oh, thank you. Thank you. I, like, heard the term a long time ago, but I only heard it, like, so rarely that I forgot what it meant. But, yeah, he is really deep into his D&D. His Dungeons and Dragon la LARPing. <laughs> I love how, because of how the way names are handled in uh, Japanese culture, that when I made him your mom, <laughs> either they address him like your, like it's a normal name, but then when they address him as mom, it's like, it just works too damn well. Yeah. I want to. Okay, what happened? I've never done this option, I don't think. What the fuck? Okay, I think. I think Angel has gotten to him. Okotsan. Put my mom. I can do that next round. And I'll like spell my as in like M A I or M E I. <laughs> so it seems like a regular ish name, though M E I would be more like May. So it would have to be the first spelling. Interesting. Oh yeah, you can. These nuts should <laughs> should work. I uh, I'll I'll do that. I I can totally put down uh my mom and these nuts.
What? He's talking about the doctor. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> oh, but force and dead man. Oh, jeez. Well, too late for that. And he tries to keep... Interesting. Oh yeah, he is full on really immersed in this shit. I mean, like, it keeps escalating fast, I guess. That the mum family tradition is to kill first and ask questions later? The mum family tradition. Though, to be fair, mum's also the name of a type of flower. So yeah, it works real well. Your mum spelled Y-O-R and then mum, M-U-M, is a completely valid name. <laughs> My crimson breast would run wild! <laughs> yeah, it is in a wild sentence. It sounds something you would hear more in like a romantic novel or something. Something, some shit from Twilight. Also, like, if anyone names, legally names themselves or, like, their child, your mom, the way that I have this character's name spelled, 
boy, that's gonna be interesting. <laughs> She breasted boobly down the stairs. Indeed. I- Oh my god, that sentence. It kind of reminds me- So there was like this video done by the YouTuber, The Click. Where he, he read a whole, like, series of Reddit posts and shit of that genre of she breasted boobly down the stairs. It's just bad writing of woman. And it, it was definitely an interesting video. It was real funny. Yeah, if you ever get a chance to watch it, do watch it. Scott Pilgrim? Is this fucking Scott Pro Pilgrim? Okay. I I'm just straight up reminded from that scene in the first in the original Scott Pilgrim movie where um it wasn't a Ramona but the other girl comes to see Scott and they're like is Scott there and Scott fucking like jumps out like l straight leaps out the window while his friends cover for him I've gotten involved with a Filipino <laughs> I I <laughs> I don't know why I had to. I ended up laughing at that, but at the same time, I will admit we Filipinos are something else. <laughs> but man, <laughs> could he not be racist? <laughs> what a statement! Please. <laughs> what the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? What?
Yeah. What is this? What? We have the fucking. What's going on? What's going on? Well, I guess it's a good thing I kept spamming gym class. What the fuck? Okay, so so far in this stream we went from dead student to student with dead mom to uh oh the doctor killed us to uh Filipino <laughs> <laughs> Fil LARPing Filipino, I guess. I I don't know. Phil <laughs> Filipino Gundam Tanaka. Why must you be so correct? <laughs> that is that is an excellent way to describe the situation. It's straight up Filipino Gundam Tanaka. If Gundam Tanaka was a fellow Filipino, <laughs> that's what he. <laughs> I guess that's what he would be. What the fuck was that ride? <laughs> oh my god. Did I unlock anything? I'm looking to see if I unlocked anything new. I think this is the newest thing I've unlocked. And I, no, that I think I might have. Or actually, no, I did unlock that. So this and this I unlocked. Wait, what just the little... Don't tell me this is from you, yeah. Okay, let's see here. We can do, uh, we'll do the,
next. Man, I was like, oh, I'll try getting Yuya's root for real this time. Yeah, no, that kind of went off guard. That that kind of went, you know what? Fuck that. <laughs> Yuya out here getting cucked by everyone. Man. You 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 out here thinking he's gonna get my get his ending unlocked by me, but instead it's everyone else. I just end up using him as a stepping stone. When the ADHD kicks in, please. That's me every day. Cause I do have ADHD. <laughs> Okay, real quick, I'm checking my Steam account. I want to see, because you can see the achievements and therefore, like, what possible endings. Uh, view my achievements. So, what other... Okay, so... I still have to get Sakuya's. There's a full ending? So there's a full ending to like some of these characters. So I still need to like deal with Azami, I guess. And apparently there's another fucking shoe ending. Alright then. So I have to like do Okosan's ending again and try getting like Sakuya's ending like as well. I might as well just go with Okosan's. Yeah, we're screwing over you, yeah, one more. More chatter. More irrelevant chatter. So I gotta do the marathon. Thank you. 
<laughs> God damn it, Sans. Yeah, this is just all very interesting. <laughs> just man. Oh yeah, the if you're confused about what I just mentioned. So, at random, um, the first few notes of Megalovania are uh, like play through the stream. Because I have it programmed with BikuBot to just randomly play. So, there's moments where San just pops in at the most appropriate or inappropriate times on my streams these days. So, I sometimes respond being like, Sans, not right now. Sans, please. Yeah, pretty much. There's also, like, a very rare chance that you'll have, like, um... One of, like, three identity five characters just randomly pop up and, like, twerk. Yes, it's very rare, but it is a thing that happens on stream if you pay close attention. <laughs> Oh, so this is Oko-san. I was wondering who the fuck that was. Okay. Gaslight the viewers with pop-ups up, please! <laughs> They're just fun little Easter eggs. Okay, so I guess this is now permanently there because of, um, Shu. No. 
Yep. Son. <clears throat> There's an insect visual novel. I mean, granted, there's, like, a lot of different visual novels these days, but I never knew of an insect one. I do know of, like, a telephone one where everyone has, like, a telephone for a head, and I want to play that one. The insect is Kokono uh, Kokoro. Oh, okay. I'll have to look it up. Interesting. Yep. Yep, made birds. They look cute in the little um, made outfits. So I'm gonna make Okosan drink it. 
what's gonna happen. I made sure to save in advance, though. Okay, so we are at this stage. Let him go. For fuck's sakes. Cut down it. Okay. So it is now almost 10 p.m. So I'm gonna do my outro. But um, that was quite the development and hateful boyfriend. I will make sure to check out Coco no Kokoro. Um, as mentioned before, I plan on going to Anime Los Angeles this upcoming week of January. I will not be streaming during January 4th to 7th, which is when the convention takes place, and then I'm also not streaming tomorrow and Sunday as those are holidays. New Year's uh, Eve and New Year's Day, specifically. And then I have also bought a capture card and a converter for analog to digital. So the hopes are this will allow me to play a wide variety of the older co game co gaming consoles that I have. And also will be able to stream the Nintendo Switch. So I'm just waiting for those to arrive in the mail. Um, because I had to order them online because... The only local options were insanely expensive and everyone was just buying out all the electronics anyways. So, yeah, I had to do it online. 
and I am expecting to. It's estimated that they're supposed to be here before um, January 4th. So I might get it in time before I attend Anime Los Angeles. We'll find out. And I'll continue to stream Hitful Boyfriend until I get all the endings unlocked. I think we're making some good progress. Um, <laughs> that's all I can say for now. I hope you guys really enjoyed the stream. I had fun. I've been having fun game, having a fun time with the game so far. Um, I want to quickly shout out to um, Louis for gifting me this game a while back, and um, Sky Sky for remind for recommending it to me and um, to play it. I will quickly link their stuff. Where is the video source? So let me pull up a window specifically for um, their works or like their socials. Where is our Twitter? There is Louie's art Twitter. Okay, so I'm going to quickly link these two. And y'all go say hi and follow them. You know. Um, just give me a moment. Copy. There we go. Paste and go. So here, let me quickly screen share. Uh, what is it? Window capture, I believe. Here we go. So y'all go say hi and follow Louie and Sky. Tell them thank you for um, making making this stream possible. <laughs> so you know, go go follow them. Louis on Twitter, and I've known Louis for a very long time. And Sky, I have met last year, and uh, she does cosplay and also art. So this is Sky's work. And then oh, well, Lu I think Louis Wee Wee is gonna show up at her. So there you go. So yeah, go go support them. And uh, with that said, I'm gonna head out for the night. See y'all later. Stay safe. Happy New Year. And uh, bye bye.